Five things every Catholic need to know about Holy Thursday and the fifth will surprise you. One, Holy Thursday begins the Easter Triduum. The other days are Good Friday and Holy Saturday. Two, only two Masses are permitted on this day. The first in the morning called the Chrism Mass is presided by the Bishop together with all the priests and faithful in each diocese and he blesses the oil of the Chrism the oil of the sick and the oil of catechumen. The second mass is the mass of the Lord's Supper celebrated in the evening and presided by the priest. Three, the ceremony of the washing of the feet during the evening mass. The ceremony takes its root from the action of Jesus Christ who washed the feet of his apostles in John chapter 13 verse 1 to 17. The washing of the feet signifies service, calling us to love and serve one another. Four, on Holy Thursday, Jesus instituted the sacraments of the Holy Orders and the Holy Eucharist together. Matthew 26 verse 20 tells us when it was evening, Jesus sat at table with the twelve. And while they were at supper, Jesus took bread and gave thanks and gave it to them saying, This is my body. And he took a cup and giving thanks and gave it to them saying, This is my blood the blood of the new covenant which is poured out for many for the forgiveness of sins do this in memory of me by these sacred words he instituted the holy eucharist and the priesthood together such that without the priesthood there will be no eucharist so today you can wish all priests all over the world happy priestly anniversary wish me too five the tabernacle is empty tonight after Holy Mass and if possible left open. Ah, but why? The action signifies the arrest of Jesus by the soldiers at night who took him away while his disciples deserted him and fled as seen in Matthew chapter 26 verse 31 and verse 56. Jesus said, you will desert me tonight for scripture says, I will strike the shepherd and the sheep will be scattered. And so in churches where there are tabernacles the holy eucharist is removed and transferred to a temporal place called altar of repose as faithful disciples we are all called to spend at least one hour with jesus tonight at the altar of repose for jesus says in matthew 26 verse 40 could you not stay awake with me for even an hour god bless you